What's up everybody, how's it going? I just wanna do a quick video on how I tricked out my Epiphone Les Paul Prophecy. So, if you haven't seen the um, initial demo of this guitar or even the, I guess, upgrade or, not upgrade, but um, what's the one I'm looking for here? Uh, the result video of getting the frets fixed, I'll put uh, something here or there, <laughs> wherever it decides to go. But uh, about, I think a month, month and a half has passed since I've had this guitar. And uh, I've made some changes, as you can clearly see. Uh, we're going to start with the pickups. So I know in um, previous video I've said, you know, the Fishmans are going to stick around for a little while. Well, I wasn't half right or wasn't half wrong. Um, I just decided that uh, I just wanted some passes in this guitar. because Well, there's a few reasons. I shouldn't say I just decided because there's a couple of reasons why. Um, one, uh, going from one guitar to the other. There was a difference in volume and whatnot, and uh, uh, sometimes with the uh, the Fishmans, of course, the, the three voices, but with the push-pull stuff, it uh, wasn't the cleanest sounding. You would hear like a, a ting or like a pop, so that was kind of annoying. And um, just the randomness of like, I put in a fresh battery, but it died right away, so there's the, I want to say stress, but there's the worrying of like, is this battery good? Then I did some more research. I actually uh, caught the Fishman dudes live on Instagram and asked them, hey man, what is that exactly are in these prophecies? Because they're listed as Epiphone Fishman prophecies. It's kind of like the equivalent of DiMargio's and Ibanez guitars, but they're really not. Um, that's kind of what those were. Uh, the dude on the live feed said they're hybrid. Hybrid of what? You didn't even uh, give me a good example. Um, are they a combination of the magnets or is the preamp dialed differently? Basically, it was just the, I don't wanna say cheap, but they weren't Fishman's in my opinion. Even though they said Fishman, they were meant for the Prophecy line, not if I were to go buy them off the shelf. And also, those Fishman's were wired uh, to where I think you can plug in and uh, unplug like EMGs. I could be wrong. Um, I'm pretty sure you can with Fishman's. Those you can. And oh my God, the wiring in this guitar for those was just off the chart. Considering every pot was push-pull, there were so many wires in there. Um, I took it to professional to have the stuff completely redone. So that being said, I had passes put in. I know the camera's not picking it up, but these are, maybe they can, no, they can't. Uh, these are the Stargazer, Seymour Nuckin, JB, and Jazz. Um, I had to get a new switch. Um, as you can see, I got a poker chip here uh, that normally didn't come on the Prophecy. So almost the guitar is kind of getting blacked out um, aside of some of the chrome stuff. As I had this hardtail piece here that was black I decided to put on. As you can see, I have a kill switch and two volume, oh, here we go. <laughs> two volume, one tone. Um, I just wanted to try it. It's fun. And I only use one tone pot anyway, so I figured put a kill switch there rather than just have an empty pot or I definitely didn't want an empty space in there. So everything was been changed out to, to have passives and uh, even I got rid of the skull. I didn't get rid of there, put away. Um, I took off the skull and bat uh, stuff on here. I got a, as you can see, like a solid piece of metal uh, gears and clockwork stuff for the um, truss rod cover. So I just decided to trick this thing out, man and uh, have it have it shiny and flashy. And uh, um, I love the JB and Jazz. Um, it just smokes now going through this. I don't know if, um, it said this is, according to the Seymour site, uh, hot rotted sets, but I think it's just the design. I don't think they actually hot rotted the wiring and all that, I could be wrong. Uh, anybody have bought these hot rotted uh, sets, let me know in the comments, cause I know they sold like crimson red and toxic yellow and frost white raw nickel, etc. Um, I don't think these are available anymore, the Stargazer. Last time I checked, we'll just check right now, why not? Um, they were sold out of that, uh, but they had the other ones. Let's find out. Products, humbucker, doo -doo -doo. there we go. Hot rotted humbucker set, all right. Uh, let's see, the ultimate hot rotted humbucker pickups. Okay, that may be subjective. Um, let's see here, comes in a set, Stargazer. Oh, they got them available again. Okay, so they were sold out for a little while. Oh, no, never mind. Out of stock. They are out of stock. So Lord knows, I mean, I don't work for Seymour Nuck and I have no idea. 
in my opinion or maybe thoughts these could be a limited run they're not gonna sell them anymore if once they're gone they're gone who knows um they have put out other ones like the nazgul sentient ones have different colors now and all sorts of stuff so anyway getting off topic so that's it for this video it's just a quick thing just wanted to show off how i made it all kind of i don't want to say glam but like i don't know just made it different made it my own um i'm probably gonna get black bolts here uh this i'm gonna keep because this is a brand new bridge and it's already uh filed down to fit these strings i'm not gonna do that so i'm gonna get matching things here to go with that i know you can't see it but the input jack actually is like a, a off black chrome kind of thing uh, the input jack is all uh, not input jack the switch is all black so um almost blacking out the uh, entire guitar but leaving with some uh room for flair as um uh what was the character's name? Why am I drawing a blank? Albert. One could use a hint of color. Anyways, guys, that's it for the video. Nothing fancy. Um, not going to do sounds. If you hear a JB, you hear a JB. Nothing nothing to that. And uh, jazz, same thing. The pickups have been around forever. So that's it, guys. Hit subscribe and that bell. I don't know what's coming next. Um, if you haven't seen my latest video of my first ever uh, guitar instrumental song, Suspended, uh, make sure you watch that. Uh, let me know how it sounds because two people have said the rhythm guitar sounds scooped, but when I recorded them, they weren't. I think I just have them low in the mix. That's that's the only thing that it is. They're not scooped guitars at all. Um, I think I just have them lower than everything else because I wanted to hear the keyboards, I wanted to hear the bass, but it's my first go round too of mixing real drums and like full on instruments and stuff, not just uh, Sunday with Ola demos, which is just drum, fake drums, one guitar track and a bass track. So anyways, guys, thanks for watching and we'll see you later.